here we are at the Metal Hall of Fame on the Metal Voice, and with us, introducing the new bassist of Merciful Fate. Becky Baldwin. He, he, not Betsy. Not, not Betsy. Betsy. Don't say Betsy or Betsy. <laughs> All right. So it was just, just, just recently announced. Has this been in the works for a while? I know that you have been the replacement, right? I mean, I guess like the ideas were floating around for a while, but um, but you know, it's, it's it's quite recent still. Um, the news that I was uh, going to be permanent in Merciful Fate, but I guess you know, as any band does, like when you've got a lot coming up and there's some kind of um, I, I don't want to say insecurity within the band because it's not that. It was just kind of like a question about um, how busy Joey was, and I guess it was kind of in the back of the mind. And the way that uh, the fans reacted when I did the tour was very positive. So it kind of it was a natural progression, I guess. So, uh, but yeah, it all just kind of came about very, very recently in terms of being solidly like, yes, this is what's happening, um, and you're going to be a full-time member of Merciful Fate. Was it King's wife that brought you in originally? Um, I think the the main person for bringing me into the picture uh, was Hank Sherman. So he was the person who um, suggested me when they started looking at like, okay, well, actually, like this whole list of male bass players that we're looking through. It doesn't have to be a guy. Like, who else do we know? Are there are we like should we start looking somewhere else because you know there, there aren't any women on this list and maybe I could be a thing I could work out for Merciful Fate um, and then I was kind of at the top, top of Hank's list and then when he showed King and, and the rest of like, the management and stuff um, some of my videos um, it was literally the weekend of Bloodstock uh, Bloodstock Festival in, in the summer of 2022 and they were like okay let's, let's go let's go to Bloodstock and she's going to be at Bloodstock Festival let's ask her there <laughs> Look, the reality is they're all aging, like we all do, and it's nice to have new blood in the band, right? Are you looking forward to perhaps injecting some songwriting as well? I mean, I think like the songwriting is still going to be very much King Diamond and Hank Sherman um, kind of heading up most of that. Um, but definitely writing bass lines, you know, I've, I've studied all of Timmy's like bass lines like very uh, meticulously now, and so I, I really feel like I can bring some of that into into the new bass lines for the next record. Does the Merciful Fate scare you? Their legacy, their history, of all this satanic stuff? Oh, right. No, not really. Like, uh, I mean, I, I guess it just their legacy in itself is scary. Like, it's you know it's such a big thing and it's such a big part of my life growing up that it's all just very daunting i guess and like trying to get it right is daunting and scary um but the satanic stuff no not really <laughs> all right well there you have it becky baldwin the new basis for merciful fate as well as fury correct? fury yes fury so do you have anything to promote with fury um our latest album's called born to sin please like stream that online and buy it from our website furyofficial.co.uk um, and then, yeah, we'll be coming out with a new album, hopefully later this year. All right, there you have it, Becky Baldwin.